Hey Andrew, so everything you just said in your video is exactly what uh, I've been actually been thinking for a couple months now. Especially when I saw John's video when he did it. I'm like, John's right. I mean, why should you know people like YouTubers have to cater to certain things like like thumbs up this video and leave comments and you know go and like do other things it's like why is it that you know you have to do that because the answer is you don't have to do that nowhere does it say that you have to say you must thumbs up thumbs up the video and leave comments in the doobly doo and go from there it doesn't Nowhere does it say you have to do this. YouTube should be about what you want to do. It's like, you want to make a video? Make a video. But you don't have to cater to what other people are doing so you can get views and subscribers. Um, yeah. Um, also... I'm also doing this video response is because as you were as you stated in your video you're right Andrew <laughs> kind of strange Andrew talking to Andrew <laughs> but yeah you are right video response is basically a dying art form and nobody does them anymore like people always say you know um, I'm gonna use an example of Outback Zach he goes like some other lunatics in the form of a comment or video response. He always says video response in all his videos, but the problem is I don't think I've ever seen a technical video response for any of his videos. Because he always says like most funniest most funniest comments or interesting videos will be featured at the end of his next video. The problem is you always see the comments. You're there's never been like someone's reaction or views to that video and um, that's kind of sad because the only people I can think that you know stressed video responses enough is you guys which I mean vlog candy because I mean that is something I'm so happy that you guys basically stressed so much that you wanted us the viewers to do the challenges along with you guys because it was actually fun doing those challenges. I mean, I wish I was able to do all, like, almost all of them, but I came into Vlog Candy last year in 2010, and I am in college, so I don't have time to do all the challenges. But the ones I did do, I'm I'm very glad I did do them. Besides that, it's like, I'm so glad that Vlog Candy mm, expressed that, yes, we're doing the challenges, all five of us but we want you the viewers to do the challenges along with us because like as you're saying comments are good like everybody loves comments like everyone's like oh like oh I've got comments so, you know you, you you look at the comments and you know your response to comments but video response means that you're taking the extra step to actually do uh, whatever or you're going the extra mile to like not only have I left a comment I'm also doing a response because I'm like so impressed with what you've done or what you have said and now that like vlog candy is over though there was <laughs> for a brief minute at about this afternoon because you all because by now you do know that John accidentally uploaded his Easter video to Vlog Candy. I was like they have just pulled off the biggest prank in the history of pranks. Cause I was expecting like, haha, we fooled you. We had you all going the whole week and we had you all going to pie candy and you completely we completely fooled you guys. I'm like if that had happened I would still support and be part of Law Candy, but it also would be like, 
I'm so glad you guys cannot see what I what I'm doing with my fingers right this moment. Uh, getting back to subject now is I agree with basically what you're saying. YouTube does need to go back and do what it used to do, like featured people. No one's really featured anymore. It's a stupid. It's called spotlight, but they're on YouTubers. It's about some event or those stupid celebrity playlists. Like, I don't care what celebrities are watching. I mean, I don't care about celebrities at all. I can't stand them. Same as, like you said, back in... Okay, I joined YouTube back in 2006. And at that time, people were featured, like you said, and there wasn't a limit to what you could put, what, what you could basically upload. Because at that time, the very first video I've ever uploaded to YouTube was the capsizing scene from the original 1972 Poseidon Adventure. And then from there, my next one was the shoplifting scene from Empire Records. Now, you can't upload TV shows or movies because it goes along with the matches third party content. But back then when I did uploaded it, there was no there was nothing that said that you couldn't or couldn't do it because other people do it. So I said, well, basically everybody else is doing it, so I guess I can do it. But now you can't do that. What was the question? Oh yeah, video responses and how YouTube is not what it was back in its glory days. Um, at least I can say in all the videos that I have I have done as vlogs have never been hey I made a video thumbs it up or thumbs it down and leave lots of comments and you know subscribe to me. I've, I've never told anybody to do that because I feel like they're smart enough, if they're watching this, to like, hmm, he's interesting, I'll thumbs it up, I'll leave a comment. I don't think, I do not need to be told every single video I watch, thumbs up the video, leave a comment, subscribe. I mean, I, I do have eyes, so I can see the thumbs up button, I can see the subscribe button, and, you know, I might be slow oh hell let's say fix it I am I mean I'm not the smartest I'm not the smartest person nor the fastest person but the little hamster up here that runs a little wheel is you know enough for me to think okay this is interesting type 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 okay post comment I so I don't need to be told to do something that I can already, you know, figure out on my own. Uh, it's a shame that, you know, people like us uh, don't, you know, get the exposure that, you know, we um, not, ne ne not necessarily deserve, but, like, should at least get, because, I mean, uh, I remember when I got, like, my comments got featured in, like, people's uh, video like um, Scott K. Martin's video like my uh, like I'll leave I like I always leave a comment and then like sometimes it'll get featured at the end of uh, the next video or whatever but it's like I guess in a way you know that's kind of exposure but it's not enough that like we should technically be getting like I won't technically mind being featured on the home page back on topic here you um you should try to do something like uh as I've come to figure out if you basically hound complain and basically whine complain and such eventually uh 
either um, you're going to get nowhere or whoever you're trying to beg and plead to will give in. Uh, not necessarily all the time, but I've seen it, like, basically, if, like, enough fans, like, TV show, okay, a TV show example, um, let's take, uh, you can't do that on television. Now, I don't know if any of you people who may watch this even know what you can't do on television is. Uh, what it is, it was a very popular show that was on Nickelodeon and it was a sketch comedy series it was from Canada so Andrew technically you may know what I'm talking about with you can't do it on television but as I'm saying this example let's say take you can't do it on television and if enough fans express the um, desire to have the show on DVD uh, then eventually it will come out on DVD so where to basically tell YouTube and like go to them if you were actually to go there and express to them there has to be somebody on who works there that was like okay well we do feature big known people but I think we should also give the little people um, their due um, so I I'll support you with uh, whatever you do in your uprising and you know join your underground you know communist um, revolution so, um, all about I got to say about this and uh, It's good to uh, see you're making videos again, and uh, hope you uh, continue to make these videos on your channel. Uh, you just stay the cool person you are, and uh, of course, vlog candy forever. Alright, uh, see you around the tubes, I guess, and then who knows, maybe some distant down the road maybe we'll actually meet in person someday bye 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 bye